so thank you so much sir for coming uh, to this event and we really really had a lovely session listening to you so a couple of questions that we would like to ask you sir uh, why is raising awareness about sickle cell disease so crucial today in in, in today's life why do you think it is so crucial see this is a genetic disorder since many many years hmm. but the people are not aware of it correct people are aware of thalassemia but not aware of sickle cell anemia correct so but naturally uh, when uh, these people are suffering from this disease and particularly from the tribal areas uh, it is not that uh, the, it is confined only to tribal but uh, most of the people are tribal they are coming from the backward area and uh, iec information education and communication plays an important role particularly uh, uh, in this uh, diseases and uh, there should be a co- good political will uh, to implement the programs in the these areas where so far it was neglected so it is very important hmm. and sir since you are part of this and sir, ht has created this event this taken up this initiative to let people know so what what is your views on to it what do you want to say about that one has to uh, one has to make it loud people should be aware when the crack thalassemia right. sickle cell anemia is also there mm. there are more people are suffering from this disease who are not aware of their own uh, own genetic condition correct so far they are misdiagnosed and mistreated mm. so all this information which you bring to the people Uh, is definitely going to help them and improve their lives. Yeah, and media amplifies yeah. so that definitely, definitely. works. Definitely, yeah, please, much more. Yeah. So, sir, and uh, so if you have to just give one pointer to everybody who has attended this event today, so what do you think is going to be one takeaway that you would like to let the audience know? Yes, treatment is one part mm. for sickle cell anemia, which government is doing excellently at the moment. Right. one of the world's best probably i can say oh that's nice because uh, i have i have travel in usa i have travel in africa uh, 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 west indies uk and other places where wherever there are african american born or uh, african uh, origin born people sickle cell is always there so among them we are we are having very good uh, medical services for these people second part which is very important now is to uh what our uh, prime minister narendra modi has uh, uh, announced that by 2047 Two we should not have a birth of a sickle disease child so this is very important task and uh, every people should uh, act on that particularly regarding uh, um if um, pregnant woman they should be screened their husband should be screened if right. positive right. and um pnd that is prenatal diagnosis can be offered to them which is offering uh, offered by government free of cost mm. and people should come forward for that so uh, this is very important and we have to accept new technologies also mm. our prime minister says to accept um, use new technologies so one of the technologies ivf with pre implantation genetic diagnosis right well you can use either uh, sperm or ovum which is free of such uh, genes mm. and we can have a normal healthy child yeah so this is very important and the cost of uh, um, um, treatment uh, throughout the life is, is much more less or much more high affordable. than this ivm plus tgl oh. that is pre implantation okay. times okay sir thank you so much sir for your time i'm looking forward thank to you. your in further associations as well thank you so thank much sir you.